from the Scripps Studios, this is 10 News. I'm Jim Patton with this 10 News update. Police say a good Samaritan was shot and died at the hospital after stopping to help a disabled car on the 15 freeway in Mountain View. Police say the victim was 21 years old. He and his girlfriend stopped on the freeway after 2 o'clock this morning when they saw someone that they thought was a stranded driver. When the victim stepped outside the car to help, the suspect shot him and then took off. The ramp from the 15 south to the 5 north was closed for the investigation just past the Ocean View Boulevard exit. Two people have been detained. Well, three people injured, one critically after a mega yacht collides with a 65 foot sport fishing vessel off the coast of San Diego near Mexico. Happened just before 8 o'clock last night. Coast Guard rescued a total of 17 people after the collision. The person critically injured was airlifted to a hospital. Ten other people were transferred back onto the yacht. The cause of the crash under investigation. Well, today, the big showdown game between Notre Dame and Navy. There was already a pep rally on the Broadway Pier yesterday. Hundreds of Irish fans got into the spirit, taking pictures with cheerleaders and viewing highlights from past games. And tonight will mark the 92nd meeting between the two rivals. Kickoff at 5 p.m. at SDCCU Stadium. Tickets are still available. Time now to get a check on the weather with Mel. We are dealing with morning fog, but afternoon sunshine. Our seven day forecast here along the coast. Temperatures today will be above average, and then we're going to drop to the mid 70s by Sunday. You do see that warm up, though, as we get ready for Halloween. In our inland valleys here, upper 80s today, lower 80s by Sunday. Heading to the mountains, we're going to be in the 70s. Pretty hot in the deserts for the next couple of days, Jim. All right, Mel, thank you for the latest news, weather and traffic. Go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News app in your app store. For 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.